Welcome to episode one of Wing It with me, John McGrath. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, we've got a wonderful establishment called Peck and Yard today. Uh, but first, I want to tell you a bit about myself. My CV includes getting put through a table at a live radio show, going on holiday with strangers, racing a tram. Being the producer of the Stephen Tries podcast. Uh, Joe, thank you for coming on. How would how would you spend your last day and make it your happiest? With Ryan's girlfriend. <laughs> yeah! And also the host of Wing Festival, the UK's biggest wing eating festival, and it's beauty. But now I'm here with my own YouTube channel to put forward to you the best reviews of the best wing places in the country. Episode one, we welcome Peck and Yard. Absolutely unbelievable. I contacted the guys beforehand and said, listen, I'm coming down, fancy eating some wings, I want to do it for my channel. And they prepared a feast for me. As we can see, it's not just the wings that they prepared, some incredible sides. I'm not going to review them, but I'll just mention them here. Uh, the uh, egg fried rice. Wow, salt and pepper chips. Beautiful. And then came the wings. Plain wings, double fried, with the sauces. I'll go on a bit more in the actual review. Pecking yard, Cholton, let's go. So that it sort of stays crunchy, uh, but at the same time not greasy. Wing it. So this is my first one. You've seen it being prepared, and it's time for me to taste. So many people have said to me, I mean, when I said I'm going to do this YouTube channel to come here, I might as well just get stuck in. Wings are a messy thing to eat. So if you want to turn away for a couple of seconds, well, I get stuck in. Honestly, I know I say I love wings, but there's so many good reasons why I love wings. These are unbelievable. Double fried, like you've seen already, and they're just absolutely delicious. We rate things on Wing It three different categories. You've got appearance, the value for money, and you've got taste. And then the additional one, which is heat, because if you sell a hot sauce, we've got to try it. One thing I've got to say, and what Ed mentioned before, is like when he talked about the double dipping, the double frying, it doesn't leave that greasiness on your hands. Do you know when you can go to those, maybe after a big night out, those fried chicken places, and you're swimming in the stuff. Honestly, I don't know what the double frying technique does, does something unbelievable to the chicken. Beck and Yard done one of those things that I adore. Do you only get a wing and it's attached, and next thing you know, you've got the, the drum and the drum, and you've got to snap it apart, sauce everywhere, boiling art, chaos, absolute chaos. Ed's done the hard work for you. The wonderful kitchen staff separate the wings for you, coated them, fried them. This is top dollar. Just have a look at that. This is the sauce I was raving about. It's a peanut sauce. Ah, there's just something in it. It's magical. I'm gonna say it's, I'm gonna say it's probably one of the nicest sauces I've ever had. Is that bold of me? It's a bold claim, in it? But 100% one of the nicest sauces I've ever had. I know a good wing where the wings and the bones just come off like that. Absolutely stunning. My wing eating time, that's when you know you've got an absolute beauty on your hands. I'm probably gonna rank it as we go through. Now appearance. You're telling me this rocks up, you know, over the moon. You're telling me if this lands as a wing fan in front of you with the sides, which we'll get onto in a minute, with the array of sauces, with the wings looking as good as that, you are over the moon with just how good this is. So we're going to break things out of 10, and I can't fault it. 
It's got to be a 10 out of 10. Surely got to be a 10 out of 10. I'm going to try Ed, his favourite sauce. Now it's the hot one. So I'm going, to, I'm going to slather it on. Whenever we go to a wings place and they have a hot sauce edition, we're trying it. Oh my God. Just so you can see a bit of evidence that I'm not messing about. Hey, that slathered in it. Wish me luck and I'll tell you about the heat. The sauce game in this place is another level. Right. What's good is that hot sauce there, got the sweetness to it at the start, so nice and the little kick after just works so well, that crispiness of the wing and that double dip, I've got to go in again, it's hot sauce everyone can enjoy, no messing about, it is honestly one of the nicest, Ed you should sell this in bottles, I've got to try the rice. Uh, oh, thank you very much, Ed. Ed's can't he? he be a four. How good is Ed, by the way? The passion in Ed. Ed, you want a wing, by the way, Ed? Do you, do you want to come and have a wing? Oh, I am. He's all right. <laughs> How many wings do you have a week? Uh, I can't count it, bro. I love it too much. <laughs> he loves it too much. Let's move on to some of the other sauces. Ed, what's this one at the end? It's called Miyagi. Miyagi. Sweet sticky. Sweet sticky. Miyagi. Sweet sticky. Let's see that. Can you get that? Every single sauce just blows any other sauces out of the water. I, I don't know, I can't describe it to you without you coming down and trying it. I think the bar has been set a bit too high. That was always going to be the danger of me doing this, as I'd forget that I was actually reviewing the place and I'd just get stuck in and I'd be like, oh yeah, camera. The heat was out of 10, the appearance was 10 out of 10, the value for money. And all this is about tw or just about 20 quid. All this, I can imagine you and the mate, 10 of each. Unbelievable fried rice, gorgeous wings. I've got to give value for money nine out of ten. Maybe I've set the bar a bit too high. But my lasting memory of this place: the wings are on point, the sides are on point. What stands out about everything else is the sauces are unbelievable. You can eat them wings dry, 100%. Look how crispy they are. But the addition of the hot sauce, the peanut sauce, of the sticky sauce, of the coconut and mango sauce. Mixing and matching your flavours with your mates who you sit with, or you can do what I've done and try and tackle it by yourself. Unbelievable value for money, taste on point, admire it, and thank you for watching Wing It. And that was my review. What a score. Peckin' Yard, you smashed it. Next week, we're back with another Wing Review. I'll see you there.